My name is Charles Valvin Evans. I'd never done anything in the Native American artwork until I came back here from New Jersey and I met Arnold. So he got me started and got me interested in it. So I started working and then I took a pottery class at the Hollywood School years ago on Arnold's instruction. And from him I began to learn a lot of things about different things and different stuff. And so I just went to go to work, you know, and sometimes he would tell me something about something, but the only thing he ever taught me was pottery, really. But I learned stone carving from him. I mean, I, I, he showed me stone work, and he gave me a couple of stones, and I went to work. And I got to looking for it, and I looked around until I found it. And so I've been working for, this has probably been 30, 30 years or more. Pottery was the first thing I learned. And then uh, stonework was the second. Um, and I had did some leather work, but not much. And then I went and got into drums. Uh, and I learned to make drums. But nobody wouldn't quite tell you how to make the drum bass. Although they were one or two new. But by being a carpenter and doing construction work, I kept working on it until I figured it out. I know that some of this I have in me come from my grandfather on my mother's side. He couldn't read, but he knew his name and that was about it. But he had a lot of knowledge about him, about life and plants and animals, hunting and fishing, and, and he knew how to do, he was good with his hands about doing a lot of things. Artwork is something that when you doing it, like when I'm at home working, I'm by myself and I'm comfortable. As long as I'm at the house working and I feel like working, I don't have to have nobody around me. I'm comfortable. I'm happy, you know, and I love doing it. It's, it's, it's uh, uh, whatever it is I want to do, I just go at it and I love to do it. You know, it's, uh, artwork shows a lot about you, really. You put yourself in your artwork. If somebody buy your pot or your pipe or whatever, they buy a part of you. If you give it to somebody, you're giving a person a part of you. Um, some people won't tell nobody nothing. But you know what? I think it's healthy for the arts that I share what I know with other people or we share what we know with each other. I don't think I should cut somebody's throat to keep them from doing anything, you know, because it's all over. Each tribe have a particular symbol. And so when they make all the group that makes crafts in this group, they cannot put their stuff in this group unless, and use that symbol unless they make top quality stuff. And I would like to see that here. So I'm sturdy learning. I don't, uh, I don't feel like nobody ever learns at all. But you can always keep learning no matter how old you get or whatever. You know, and I don't know it all. Somebody else knows some things that I don't know. And I love to talk with people that know things like that.